you're probably already a cheese lover, but there's a lot of fascinating and yummy things out there to discover. Your cheese concierge is here to help. Today I'm bringing you Harbison from Jasper Hill Farm in Greensboro, Vermont. Jasper Hill is a dairy farm with an on-site creamery and aging caves. Basically, they can control everything from start to finish, from the animal's feed all the way through to the consumer here with the packaging. And one thing to note is their slogan, a taste of place. They name all their cheeses after local landmarks or members of the community. Anne Harbison was called the grandmother of Greensboro. What's unique is that this cheese is wrapped in local spruce wood and yes, covered in mold. But don't worry, it's harmless and it's intentionally left on. There's even a note about it on the label. They must have had a lot of customer questions. You're definitely gonna wanna take this cheese out of its plastic wrap a minimum of 30 minutes prior to eating. That way, any trapped odors can dissipate and the cheese will come to room temperature. It's gonna be softer that way and tastier too. Even better is to store this cheese in wax paper until you intend to eat it, because this rind actually needs to breathe. This cheese appears to be quite soft in the middle. For a lovely presentation, simply trim off the top rind using the tip of a sharp knife. Work your way carefully around the cheese, but resist the urge to peek until you've gathered up everyone, because the next moment is gonna be a showstopper. You're probably gonna wanna film it and post it on your social media. Three. Two, one, oh yeah. Look at that. That's some gooey goodness. Harbison becomes softer as it matures. It's scoopable and dunkable. Let me show you an idea about how to make a whole meal out of this cheese. But before we do, if you've enjoyed this video so far, please give it the thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel. I mean, just look at this drawer full of cheese we can talk about. Okay, let's get back to it. You're gonna start by roasting some little waxy potatoes. Toss them in oil with some salt and pepper and some chopped fresh rosemary if you have it. When your potatoes are almost where you want them, throw on some asparagus, a little olive oil, salt and pepper again. It only takes a few minutes in the oven to cook them through. Now your potatoes are nice and crispy and oh yeah, you should be cooking some chicken nuggets at the same time in that hot oven. That's right, I said chicken nuggets. They're gonna be excellent dunked right in that cheese. And it's a beautiful thing to make your whole dinner right in the oven. If you wanted to go really crazy with it, you could warm up the Harbison as well. I would have liked a few more asparagus for this family meal, but it's what I had. The earthiness of potatoes goes perfectly with Harbison. It's creamy, tangy, and tastes a little like the forest floor. Those nuggets though, you're never too old to eat chicken nuggets. Let's just say it was a hit with my family. The flavor does get a bit stronger and more funky as you scrape close to the rind. We tried to get every little bit. Then just for fun, we pulled it completely apart at the end. And that's Harbison. I hope you seek out this delicious cheese. And remember, if you can't find it at your store, you can order directly from Jasper Hill Farm. They do a great job with shipping. I highly recommend it. And you can even sign up for one of their monthly clubs. Happy snacking.